Uh, ladies and gentlemen, magic. <laughs> you know, the, um, the best magic starts simply. Starts through, um, through repetition, through doing something over and over and over again. Because when you have a trick, ah, now. That's when the eye of the beholder truly finds something beautiful. I mean, truly finds it perfect as a trick, right? I had a, a, a Master of the Universe Magic Man moment a few years ago. I was working at the John Hancock Observatory in Boston. And I go out for lunch one day, sitting on a park bench, eating a sandwich. And this bird comes up to me, a little sparrow. So I toss him a piece of bread, and he flies away. Thanks, man. I'm like, all right, bro. <laughs> and he comes back with a few friends. So in seconds, I'm surrounded by birds. I was like the tuppence lady in Mary Poppins, right? <laughs> and it went on like that for a few days. I'd sit on a park bench and feed 500 birds. And now, if you've ever fed birds in public, you know that after a little while, they start to trust you. I mean, they get a little closer, a little closer, until you can just feed a bird right out of your hand, right? And they fly away. And then you graduate to where the tuppence lady really was. You're just holding out bread and they're doing flybys, taking the bread and keep flying. <laughs> now on Thursday of that week, I decide to take this trick a step further. I stand out in the middle of Copley Square, I put a piece of bread in my hand, I hold it up high and a bird flies out of a tree, lands on my hand, grabs the bread and flies away. <gasps> I am Beastmaster. <laughs> Friday morning that week, I'm feeling really good, right? Weekend's coming up. Going to stay out late with friends, going to sleep late. I walk out into the middle of Copley Square. No bread, no sandwich. I throw my hand out, and a bird screeches out of the sky, lands on my hand, and this guy, maybe two yards away, goes, Oh, shit! <laughs> you guys see that bird and that guy? That guy's a bird man! Now the bird sees that there's no bread in my hand, the bird flies away, but the guy is still like this. <laughs> so I give him one of these, right? Talking about... <laughs> this, like, this like knowing nod, you know, like, that's right, friend. You discovered my alter ego. I am the bird man. And I walk back into my building. In that instance, I was king of the birds. And in that man's eyes, I'm probably still the magic bird man. Thank you. Woo!